everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivory Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you are new to the channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button and remember to share because sharing Ivory and Spice is caring. Blah. And today guys, it's Manchester United 9, Southampton 0, Manchester United sexing up Southampton differently on a different scale. They sexed them up, guys. Oh, oh my God, it was peak out here. Different positions. It was raw sex, fam. Oh my God. It was missionary, doggy style, sideways, cowgirl, reverse cowgirl, fam. In the kitchen, in the bathroom, in the toilet, in the park, in the cinema. Even outside of school, it was that peak. Fam, in fact, it was rape. It was rape. You needed to call the police. Fam, where the police at, bro? Southampton got it. And, bro, I'm not going to lie to you guys. Hats up to Oli. Because when I first saw that story, like, I was pissed. I was like, Oli, why are you coming again wearing a condom, playing McFred, Lindelof, and McGuire? I knew this guy was going to play defensively against Southampton. But, boy, Oli, bro, you can smack me in the face. I got it wrong. But today, he came in there, said, you know what? I'm taking the jimmy off. I'm at home. I'm with my wife today. You get me? I'm going to give it that raw sex, bruv. And, bruv, we got that today, bruv. Southampton got pammed. Ah, peak out here, fam. Let's go straight into that match because, boy, Southampton starting the game off with a man down, you know, ram pump up on ram pump up on. I just shut a man down like Rihanna, bruv. Straight up in the first two minutes. Bro, I don't even know what that guy was thinking. I know you're new, you're fresh, and you and you was excited, and you had a boner, and you're stiff. You was like, yes, yeah, my debut, like. But ah, oh, I feel for you, bro. Stuff like that can ruin a football's young footballer's careers. Like from now, he he will never be the same. He will never be the same. Like his manager was probably pissed off. Looked at him like, I ain't giving you another chance. Hopefully, you get your chance, bro. I hope you do. With Southampton being a, a man down, whew, I thought to myself, I hope that Manchester United can break the line because, we, you know, we are shit at breaking the lines. We've been shit. And today, we was on another level. We was, we thought we was Barcelona today. Like, we're just doing madness today. Aaron Wan-Bissaka scoring that goal. Delightful cross by Luke Shaw. Ah, oh, Luke Shaw has been something else this season, you know. Bro, who are you, Luke Shaw? Like, man, I recognise you, you know. I don't recognize Luke Shaw because you know me, I used to say Luke Shaw is a half-hearted Don. I would never take him anywhere if I was riding out because I, I know Luke Shaw, bruv. He will come out with me, we're gonna ride out and he'll be that guy that'll be like, let me out, man. Let me out, man. And now you know me, I'm on the, I'm driving the whip. I'm like, oh, this guy, man. Let him out where other people call him the pussy, bruv. You're a bitch, bruv. What's going on, fam? And then, you know, these days now, Luke Shaw, you're some next crowd. You're on the passenger side with me, like, cleaning up the thing, like, wiping the thing, getting it ready for me. Like, yeah, that's going to ride, fam. Because you're on a different level, Luke Shaw. I am so pleased to see this type of Luke Shaw because I don't recognise him, bro. Before it was Luke on Shaw. But now I'm sure. I'm really sure. Are you guys sure? But, yes, with that goal going in, 2-0 Marcus Rashford, Greenwood with the beautiful cross and the assist, my guy. And then Marcus Rashford again crossing it in, making it 3 0 with an on goal. Southampton by then they were finished. They were, I told you by that time, they were shaking, bro. You know those times when you got the woman, you know, and it's it's peak right now, it's like it's it's deep into that round, bro, where she's all saying stuff that you never heard before. Them type of situations there. That's what Southampton was doing because Raf Hossam Hossam was saying shit that I couldn't believe in the sideline. He was beating. His heart was crying. But yes, Cavani again. Luke Shaw. Oh, cross. Mwah. Cavani with a beautiful header, making it four nil half time. I was thinking, ah, beautiful. This is lovely, guys. This is what I want to see. This is exactly what we we want to see. Manchester United holics in it. Going in there. Half time again. Although Southampton scored an offside goal, we made it 5 0 with Martial smashing in the ball in 
from a Bruno Cross and Bruno's back at it again with another assist. It's been five games he's been missing, but he's back at it again. And then out of nowhere, Scott makes sauce with that long strike, making it 6 0. At that time, we're cruising, we're oozing, we're sourcing out here, you know. We're enjoying it like I'm on a brilliant ride. I'm thinking, bro, this is a nice ride. I feel like I'm in Horton Towers. I'm on that Nemesis Inferno ride out here. Like, I'm there going, ah! screaming out and I'm like thinking this is amazing this is awesome but hey I'm scared but yeah guys I got gas there again nine men now two men off Arsenal had the same thing <laughs> I'm telling you guys it was nice to see Arsenal two men down bro and of course with Southampton being two men down with that red card leading to a penalty Bruno Fernandes making it 7-0 at that time, you can still see Raf Hussam Hussam bleeding by that time, bro. 8 0 Marshall again. And by that time, when Marshall scored his second goal, brilliant touch, brilliant finish. My man's not smiling. And what do you expect when you're being racially abused? I would never smile if I was being racially abused. Would you smile? No, you wouldn't. He ain't smiling no more. This is what you've guys done to Marshall. You've got him mad. He's turned mad now. He's on this crud shit. He's back now. I think he's back. He did miss a chance where he tried to chip it over the goal. He missed it and I thought, this is the reason why, Marshall, you need to be clinical. This is the reason why people start talking nonsense. But then again, we don't accept racism. If you're racist, get out of here, bro. And then Bruno, again, another assist to Daniel James, who has been missing DJ. You know, missing the nightclubs, not being able to DJ on a regular basis anymore because people have been cancelling his shows. He scored a goal and I was pleased for him, you know. Full time, 9-0, three points was already in the bag. You know, we did a 3-0 whitewash on Southampton times three today, you know. Record-breaking win as well, guys. You know, the biggest margin we've ever won within the last 28 years. Props to Oli for getting everything right. But then again, Southampton was a man down. Then they became nine men down. By the time they were, they, by the time they had nine men, you know, we already packed them in and finessed them. So we can't say anything about that, guys. But I'm pleased with that, man. Overall, I'm just pleased with that win. Um, just on to the next team, as always, bruv. As always, let's just hope that the team can carry this momentum and do a thing. I believe we've got Everton. Hopefully we can spank them again at Old Trafford. Because we did play them at Goodison Park last time, as I remember. My man of the match, guys, it's got to beat McSauce, man. At first, if the if it was the first 45 minutes, Luke Shaw, bruv. Luke Shaw, straight up, bruv. Luke Skywalker. Pshing, you get me? But today, out of the whole 90 minutes, I thought McSauce was sourcing, oozing, as always today. He was cruising, man. You get me? Like, no donkey of the match, guys. Mm -mm, not at all, man. Not today. No one deserves it. If if it was that donkey of the match, it would have to be that guy that got sent off. That poor Southampton young buck, bro. I'm sorry for that, bro. And, guys, this has been your match reaction. You know, your boy Ivory Spice, as always, you know. Guys, ah, brilliant win. I'm in a good mood. You guys are in a good mood, guys. Manchester United Holics. Enjoy today's game because you're not going to get that again. You know, it's going to be a long time. It took 28 years for us to win 9-0. Nine, nine it might take another 20 more years, you know. You get me? And guys, as always, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, remember to share to all your friends as well across all your media platforms as well. Remember to share to people that you don't like. Girls, remember to share to your ex so he can be pissed off with me, you know. But don't come at me, bro. But yes, as always, as always, guys, remember to follow the socials. Of course, remember to follow the official Instagram account, Red United TV, which is Red United TV. One, baby. My personal Instagram account, which is Ivory underscore Spice. And also, the same goes for the Twitter. And as always, guys, yes, remember to keep it united. And also, remember to keep it Red United. I am out. Boom.